his second year at the helm, Fred Youngman has the women's soccer team headed in the right direction. For the second straight year, the Bucks improved their record, going 9-8-1 and getting back on the winning side of the ledger. But even more important, the Bucks improved dramatically on both sides of the ball. After scoring just 18 and 20 goals the previous two years, they tallied 25 in 2008. A pair of freshmen was largely responsible for the gain, as both Sarah Wolfer and Haley Struthers each scored six goals with three game winners. On the defensive side of the ball, the improvement was even more pronounced. After surrendering 37 and 34 goals in 2006 and 2007, they cut the number in less than half, giving up just 16 goals in 18 games, the lowest average since 2004. Seniors Tiffany Rolfing and Carly Radcliffe led the defensive backfield. Both played in every game and ranked first and third in minutes played. Sammy Cromartie went 6-7-1 in goal, but posted five shutouts. She allowed one fewer goal in almost three times more minutes. Senior midfielders Alana Brady and Kaylee Atkinson closed out their careers. Brady finished with nine goals and 15 assists, while Atkinson had four and five. Danielle Resendez joined the squad for one season to back up Cromartie in goal. She went 3-0 and did not allow a score in four games, including a complete game shutout of St. Thomas. Sophomores Michelle Tarasuk and Emily Burgoyne patrolled the central midfield. Tarasuk was second in scoring with four goals, while Burgoyne led the team with four assists. Freshman Ali Linera showed promise as a playmaker and ball handler in the middle third, earning starts in 14 matches, including the last eight. Junior Nikki Day also started every game in the defensive backfield, while sister Steph split time between the wing and forward. With 17 players returning in 2009, the Bucks will look to continue marching back to the top of the Sunshine State Conference.